Firefighter Penny Morris has just moved into a new cottage. It needs doing up. The garden certainly needs a trim. No chance of getting the weeds under control this week. Beep, beep. Hop in, lovely girl. Ponty Pandy, Trevor. And don't spare the horses. Oh, late, are you? I want to be early today because it's Sam's first day of holiday. That fire station will be like a bus without a driver. It'll take a big man to fill Sam's wellies. And I'm covering for him. Oh, yes, 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 quite. Uh, how's the garden coming along, Penny? Tell you what, I got some gorgeous bedding plants down the allotment. They'll fill your borders a treat. There's a lot of rubbish on the box these days. Mind you, I do like the odd documentary program myself. Did you see Scoop Wales last night, then? It's about sinking houses. It's not news to me, of course. I've always known that this town was built on a rabbit warren of old mining tunnels. Oh, the bunny rabbits go down the mines? No, you silly woman. That's just the way you're talking. All I'm saying is that the earth beneath our feet isn't half as solid as we think it is. Any second, the ground could swallow you up. Fireman Sam's not used to taking holidays. He's bored already. How about a game of rounders? Well, come on, Uncle Sam. I don't think so, kids. Well, we could play British Bulldogs. Don't you think that's a bit rough? Sorry, you two. I'm just not in the mood. Well, what about hide and seek? I think I'll just give the fire station a call. See how things are going. Rather a fine aroma of traditional breakfast fare, Firefighter Morris. You can tuck into this all week while I'm staying at the station, sir. Ah, excellent. Breakfast as in the years B.C. Before Cridlington. <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Uh, mo morning, Cridlington. Ponty Bandy Fire Station. Oh, hello, Sam. Sunning yourself on the Costa del Porth call? No. No, not quite. I I'm in the phone box outside Dillis's shop. I, I was wondering how things were going. We're all fine here. Everything in the garden's lovely then, is it? You don't need uh, anything doing? Well, if you're desperate for something to do... You could always weed my garden. Oh, no problem. I'll be there in two ticks. I've had enough of taking it easy to last me a year. Yes, it doesn't take too long to make an impression on a cottage garden, even if it's a jungle. Ah. Whew. Well, it's as hot as a jungle. Well, that's funny. They didn't forecast thunder for today. How many flowers can Penny Morris grow in a Ponty country garden? Roses, delphiniums, perhaps a duff or two, and a... Uh, Mr. Evans! I beg your pardon. Why do you need so many plants, Mr. Evans? Well, thing is, my sugar lumps, by the time Sam has lifted all the weeds, there'll be nothing left. So we got to give the girl some flowers and shrubs to look at. Jumping geraniums. Oh, what's happening? Now then, my sugar lumps, Kew Gardens will have nothing on pennies by the end of this afternoon. She'd have to open it to the public. There'd be a queue to get in. <gasps> James!
Evans. Mr. Evans. Your coffee. Oh, my giddy aunt. Uncle, Uncle Sam. Sam. No. Don't you worry, you two. You go back and wait for me in Trevor's bus. Okay, Uncle Sam. I think I could pull you out, Sam. No, Trevor. The ground isn't safe. This is a job for the fire brigade. Use pennies full. Straight away, Sam. Aye. All right, Trev. Now who needs the fire service? Good grief. It's Fireman Sam. He's in trouble. <laughs> Present and correct, sir. Right. Let's go. You can't drown in soil, can you? Don't say things like that. Here they come. Get to work, men. Fireman Grillington, prepare our rescue line. Hurry, Penny. Oh, what on earth's happened to the garden? Oh, Sam. Better use the ejection pipe, sir. Uh, yeah, you're quite right. Uh, Firefighter Morris, prepare ejection pipe. Sorry about all this, sir. Here, here we are, Sam. Cut short of the rope. Right. Got it. Ejection pipe at the ready, sir. Proceed as quickly as you can. No time to shore up the sides. There could be another shift at any moment. Solid ground, I'm glad to say. You're safe now. Congratulations, Firefighter Morris. An excellent job. Oh, thanks, Penny. Glad to be going home, my lovely. Well, yes and no. The council says the house is safe. They've filled in the hole, but the garden must be a wreck. Let me come and have a look. Now, perhaps I can give you a tip or two. Oh, yes, perhaps you can. It's absolutely... absolutely beautiful. Hey, you can keep your Costa del Sol. It's Costa del Ponte for me every time. Welcome, Welcome home, home, Penny. Penny. 